I'm a little older. I remember when the first cell phone came out and one of the biggest mistakes I see people make is running to social media, posting things that are contrary to the injuries that they're claiming in their slip and fall case. There are some things that you don't need to put out there. I understand that we're very social beings and we have all of this multimedia stuff. Again, as I mentioned earlier, I remember when the first cell phone came out. Now everybody has access to information right in the palm of their hands. I often tell clients that are personal injury clients and specifically slip and fall clients here in Arizona, it's not wise to say everything across social media to tweet and Snapchat and I'm pictures, I fail, but I'm fine. Well, at some point that's going to come up against you. The insurance company is going to go scrub your social media accounts. They're going to go talk to people around. They're going to look at the pictures of you playing basketball two days after you slipped and fell in this convenience store. They're going to pile all of this stuff up against you to minimize the value of your case and to say, well, you really, you really weren't that hurt or you really weren't hurt at all. So one of the common mistakes I see folks make in slip and fall cases is posting things on social media that are contrary to the injuries that they claim, running back and getting into the stream of things too fast without consulting with their lawyer to make sure that it's okay to re-enter those things, trying to heal and get back too fast when there's still injuries. They settle their case and then three months later they have injuries again. Well, they make you resign a release and a claim of liabilities. You can't go back and take a second bite at the apple. You have to be careful of all of these things. So have that candid talk with your lawyer when you call, whoever, whichever lawyer will be dealing with your case. They'll go over the do's and don'ts about your slip and fall case so that you're not making some of the common mistakes that most folks here in Arizona make.